Good afternoon and welcome to another episode of Rockerbox TV. My name is Josh Cunningham. I'm the founder and CEO here at Rockerbox. We've got another, another wonderful client success story for you today. We're joined from Ann Arbor, Michigan by Mr. Sean Smith. Sean, how's it going today? It's going very well, Josh. How are you? I'm doing excellent, man. Thanks so much for taking time out of your busy day to uh, join us here on Rockerbox TV and um, talk a little bit about some of the, the things that you've been experiencing after you know, working with Rockerbox. You've, you've been on the service now for just a handful of months, but you, uh, you said that you already are our biggest fan. So we want to just kind of shine a spotlight on you and, and talk about some of the things that you've been doing uh, with yourself and with your business. So why don't you go ahead and kind of take over and, and give our audience here a little background story, how long you've been selling real estate and um, what do you have going on with your business this year? Sure. Yeah. So um, I have a background in online lead generation and follow up just for when I started in the business. So I was buying leads through Zillow and doing all the follow up myself. So the reason I'm your biggest fan is that I've been through that process and it's, mm -hmm. it's my least favorite part of the job. So you guys are, you're saving me time and a massive headache following up with these leads. And I understand what it's like to be making hundreds and hundreds of calls just to try to convert a handful of deals. So uh, I started five years ago. Like I said, that's how I, I kind of started generating business uh, initially and um, have just grown it over the past five years to the point where I can now afford to hire a rocker box to jump on. And, and the reason that I brought you guys on is because I was using sync myself. Mm -hmm. I just reached a point in my career where I had too much, that sounds really bad, but I had too much business to focus on these online leads that were coming in. Mm -hmm. and uh, so I knew I needed an ISA and, uh, I did some research and I, unfortunately I partnered with one of your competitors initially, thankfully it didn't work out uh, yeah. as, and it's just been, it's, it's incredible, especially for any agents that are using sync. I'm not familiar with boomtown, but the way you guys just jump in there and, you know, immediately respond to leads within five minutes, just like you say, and the notes that you put in, it's, it's just incredible to track the progress. So awesome. Well, I definitely appreciate that you appreciate what we do by having done it yourself. Um, that typically makes a really good fit for uh, being an, a, a rock star client here at Rockerbox because you're right, it is a lot of work uh, and it's all throughout the day. You know, I mean, you, you're, you're an individual, uh, you have your own life, you have your own interests, you obviously want to work to make money, but you don't want to be working, you know, 160 hours a week. Uh, you got to have some time for yourself, you know, and um, that's one of the awesome things that we have here at Rockerbox is this, is this you know, team of callers that are here all throughout the day. We work, you know, short shifts. So the shifts are only four hours in length. Um, but we, we, we come in, we have a huddle, we start the shift, we're hitting the phones for several hours, and then people are clocking out and getting out of here before they get burnt out. Because we know, you know, following up with these internet leads um, can create a lot of lead fatigue. You're, you're facing a lot of rejection. You're making a lot of calls. Um, it takes a lot of work to find those few, you know, little golden nuggets. And that's why we call ourselves Rockerbox. It's an old gold mining tool. So uh, we're glad that you appreciate that. Glad that you've done that um, before in the past. Now, how long have you been on uh, Commissions Inc. now? Uh, well, so I had experience with it at my last brokerage. So last mm -hmm. year um, I had joined a team and they were using this and I had success with it. Uh, and they actually had some an assistant vetting the leads first. So mm -hmm some value to that. And, then, and like I said, uh, so I joined Keller Williams uh, in October of last year and started to do this myself and realized that I just couldn't keep up with the leads. Um, so I guess I've got about a year and a half or so experience with Sync. Yeah, nice. And you were just telling me offline before we hit the record button here, you just recently made the shift to Keller Williams. Congratulations. And um, you're already number four in production in your office. So uh, why don't you talk to me a little bit about how, you know, bringing on Rockerbox has freed up some of your time to, you know, stay involved in those higher income producing activities, working with actual motivated buyers and sellers and putting deals together and making sure that they get across the finish line. What's it been like so far? Well, so what I think is unique about my experience is that I haven't actually been taking on any of these leads until just this past week. Mm -hmm. so I brought two agents on to build a team. And like I said, I had enough business to keep me busy. So I just gave them 100% of the leads. And it was nice to be able to look at it from the outside looking in uh, and mm -hmm. just checking out the app and, and, and seeing you guys do your thing. So it's like, I, I refresh the app, we've got a new lead. I refresh it a minute later, you've already followed up. I refresh it a couple minutes later and you've connected it with one of my agents and they're following up. So it's, it's been great to see that. So I've just seen this progression, which is exactly what I experienced when I first started, which mm -hmm. is 
you get bombarded with these leads and then eventually you start connecting with a few and you, you develop those relationships and you're still collecting more leads and, and, and working through the process. And after about a month or so, you're starting to consistently show houses and then maybe a month or two later, you're starting to consistently write offers. And so that's what I've seen for the two agents that I brought on mm -hmm. uh, is that exact trend. So we're three months in with you guys and the first agent that I brought on is now consistently writing uh, contracts for the eight to 10, I'd say, active buyers that she's working with. Nice. And that I brought on was like a month, he's like a month behind her. So I'm just, I'm able to just see this progress. It's very predictable, which is great. And uh, I'd say we probably have like 10 to 15 deals in the pipeline after this. Nice. That's uh, great, man. What I'm really excited about is this watch list. Mm -hmm. That's That to me is the hardest part. If you're trying to follow up with online leads or any leads really, by yourself, you have to be extremely organized and very, very disciplined to keep up with the ones that are six, 12, 24 months down the road. Mm -hmm. And those are usually lost opportunities if you're just trying to do it yourself because it's just, it's too many leads to keep up with. So when I look at that watch list, I am so excited for 2022. Mm -hmm. The way I've been looking at this is like, we're just gearing up in these last few months of the year. If we close some deals, that's awesome but 2022 is going to be a monster year. Yeah. Yeah. And what you're referring to just so our guests here are aware, there's really three strategies we deploy at Rockerbox. The first one is calling the lead right away, which, you know, Sean already talked about, you know, we're working inside of the same platform. It's not like some add on or some different, you know, API integration. It's like, we're logging into Sean's sync account every single day. The lead comes in, we call it right away and he can see that he can see all of our notes instantly. But if they don't answer the first time, we're still going to make a bunch more attempts. So we're going to call them seven times in the first two weeks because you got to be persistent about following up with these people. But what Sean's alluding to right now, this watch list is what we call it, is when we do get someone on the phone and they say they want to buy a home, but they're more than 90 days out. Because if they're less than 90 days, those are the people, like you said, we're handing off to your agents. They're putting them in the car. They're showing them property. They're writing offers. But if they're more than 90 days out, we all know what happens with your, your typical real estate agent. That person just gets kicked to the wayside and forgotten about forever. But here at Rockerbox, we actually keep all of those leads in our platform and our team of ISAs is staying in touch with them every single month, um, making phone calls, sending text messages, sending emails, staying in front of that list of people because um, I, I always love it. Every single year, NAR produces a study on, um, you know, it's, it's a buyer poll and they, you know, figure out where the buyers are coming from what their motivation was, but there's a question that they ask on there and it says, what was the primary reason for the timing of your home purchase? And there's a multiple choice option. And a lot of the choices are very logic driven answers like financing or availability or you know prices. But the number one answer year after year by an overwhelming majority, it's normally 50 to 60% is, and I quote, it was just the right time, right? It was just the right time, that's it. Right. You're literally be being given an opportunity to say, oh, it was financing or it was availability or it was pricing. But people just go, man, it was just the right time. It's an emotional decision. And so that's why it's super important to stay in front of those leads on a consistent basis, because then you can be there in front of them when it becomes just the right time. So that's the watch list that we're working on. We're, we're scrubbing it for them. Um, until those leads buy or until they die. And um, uh, that's a, another huge value add to the work that we're doing here. So excited that you're seeing that platform, that that funnel is growing and expanding. Uh, what are some of the things that you have uh, for your own goals to continue to grow this team over the next year and into 2022? Um, so now that I'm collecting leads uh, myself, I am looking to double my business at least. And I'm pretty confident that with you guys, I can do that. So I'm hoping to get into the 15 to 20 million uh, space nice. here. Um, and I guess it's kind of it, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just keep growing, you know, up and up and to the right. That's my favorite trajectory of business, you know, from mm -hmm. the, from, from the bottom left up to the right, that's means your business is growing. So we're glad to see that you're bringing on these agents. Glad to see that, um, you know, we're partnered to business here. We love to, to think of you as an extension of our business and you to think of us as an extension of your business. Uh, and obviously we have this group of callers back here that make all the calls on a daily basis, but you also have an incredible resource in your client care manager, Brady, who's also your ramp up coach. Why don't you talk to me a little bit about some of the benefits that you've, um, that you've felt from having that interaction with Brady, who's able to, he works with all of our clients here on the sync department and he's able to actually share with you some insights as to things that look good, things that could be using improvement 
some best practices that can be shared. Why don't you talk to me a little bit more about that relationship that you have with Brady, your ramp up coach? Yeah, I mean, Brady's been amazing. He's on top of everything. He's, he, he knows what he's talking about. And I think it's valuable to have somebody from Rockerbox who's kind of doing my job in terms of just like explaining to the agents on my team what you need to be doing because it's one thing when it comes from me. It's another when it comes from, from Brady who's in there every day servicing all these clients and, and just understands like this is the way to be successful mm -hmm. uh, and has the, the numbers to back it up. So yeah, he's been incredible. I, I think we're transitioning over to Justin Gannon. Mm -hmm. yeah who seems, seems ready to go. To take yep. out. Yeah, he's been one of our, our top callers for uh, quite a while now, and he's stepping up to a manager role. So that's one of the things we like to do here is home grow our own talent. So we start with you know, these college students at Texas A&M. We train them up and build skills and create experiences for them that can lead to multiple job opportunities when they graduate. But some of them actually graduate and choose to stay with us, which is good because they've been there, they've done that, they have all the experiences, and they can share that insight with you. So uh, well, thanks again, Sean, for all your insights here. If you knew someone who is possibly considering, you know, you know hiring Rockerbox or considering, uh, you know, an ISA solution, what would you have to say to them about your experience so far? Uh, it's been absolutely incredible and it's, it's worth every penny for sure. And I do want to just kind of reiterate this point because what I'm struggling with when I talk to, especially newer agents, is uh, you have to experience this stuff yourself to really appreciate what you guys are doing. Mm -hmm. and I want to put that in perspective because I think they say that the average conversion rate for online leads is somewhere in the three to 5% range. So you've got to collect a hundred leads to try and get three to five deals. And what you guys do, I think you do seven to 10 ish calls in the first couple of weeks alone. So mm -hmm. if you think if you're getting these leads 10 times to connect them, so a hundred leads, it's a thousand calls to get three to five deals. Yeah. I'm, I'm realizing that people who haven't gone through that process and trust me, it is not fun at all. They have no appreciation for the value. So I, I'm telling you, like we, we get connected with, I think you guys connected with about 10% of the leads that, that come in every month. And then every three to four leads that we get connected with is a deal. Mm -hmm. Like that's, that's a phenomenal um, uh, conversion rate. Yeah. Like, and to your point, it's saving so much time because yep. you focus on those three or four leads at a time instead of, you know, 100, 200, 300 leads where you're making thousands of calls. So, yeah. Call on so all this. Do it. Go ahead. Sorry, go ahead. Sorry, it's, just, it's totally worth it. And it, it's, uh, it's an amazing experience. Awesome. So awesome. Well, Sean, we're uh, very excited to see where our continued partnership takes us both. And I'm um, excited to be a part of your team and uh, excited to be able to help your agents, you know, free up their time and, um, and help you build your business. And then also, all this work that we're doing here in our office helps grow our staff and, and grow their experiences as well. So it's a win-win-win for everybody. That's one of our core values. We uh, you know, act in the best interest of our customers, our company, and our coworkers. So glad to hear that uh, we're living by those values. Um, Sean, if anybody has a referral for Ann Arbor, Michigan area, they, they, got, they got a buyer, they got a seller, they got somebody that they want to put in, in the hands of a, of a top agent that they know that they can trust, how do they get a hold of you? Uh, so if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's Sean Sells Ann Arbor, and Sean is spelled S-E-A-N, Sells Ann Arbor. Um, and then my cell phone number, 734-604-3765. And you can email me at Sean C, as in Colin Smith, at kw.com. Awesome. Well, Sean, we'll let you get back to your busy day. We know you got some business to close. And uh, thanks, as always, for um, taking the time to share your success with us. And we hope you have a good day. Thanks, you too. Thanks a lot, Sean. Take care. You too. Bye.